Is it another one, Joel? <laughs> I think it is. Really? This could be potentially a Viking ship burial. Oh my god. Keep digging. Hey everyone, welcome to True Vikings. We're here in southern Finland and what are we searching for? Today we are looking for dead people buried people in mounds such as this. This one being from the Bronze or Iron Age. But we're trying to find more of that plus Viking. At least one of these. I'm gonna start digging. Yeah. Not here but <laughs> in the next place. We are of course not digging at the known protected sites, but instead we are looking to find new burial mounds that probably are scattered everywhere here in this hot spot zone beneath the moss in the forest. And that way we're gonna enrich history and bring in the archaeologists. A chieftain was buried here sometime in the past, but sadly this place has been plundered by some grave robbers sometime in the ancient past from all the gold and silver that were buried here for the chieftain to take with him to the afterlife. Emil, why did the ancient Finns bury their dead here in the middle of the forest? Well, that's an excellent question, Joel. And the answer is that this was not always a forest. One, two, three, four thousand years ago, the Gulf of Finland would have been up to here and you could have seen for miles. We came down to the coast because that's the most obvious place to start if you're a ship traveling Viking. And that's where they might have buried their chieftain. And we are just in time because someone is building a summer cottage here. They have put up the lines for the house, for the cabin. So we can consider this a uh, rescue dig. And we got the first find. That's from a sausage package. This part will hold the sausages together. Awesome Finnish culture. Beer, sausage, summer cabin, sauna. Oh man, this is the life. And the sea. Look at these moose scratch marks here. Beautiful. Oh, sorry guys for disturbing, but epic loot shop enables us to go on Viking trips like this so sorry about that but consider buying Viking themed jewelry if you're into that stuff I surely am Odin Thor hammer and Let's use continue. the discount code Ooh, true. discount code use that one as well and we'll get some beer money I have a large iron signal it could be a rusty sword do you hear this bus? That means big iron. Oh man, it's big. Gigantic. It's somewhere here. It's gonna be in my hand in less than one minute. It could have been in a Viking's hand 1000 years ago. Is it a sword? Is it an axe? Is it barbed wire? I don't know. Only thing I know is that I'm onto something good and deep. Yeah, it's deep. It's deeper. Even deeper. I got fooled by nature. It was a highly magnetic rock. Granite filled with magnetite probably. <sighs> the reason we are starting off here on this ridge extending to the sea is that it's on the same elevation as the burial mounds in the forest. 
and uh, as we all know not much vegetation grows on cliffs like this so anything dropped thousand years ago will be just below the surface unlike those finds that we find in forests and uh, and fields they can be very very deep roman artifacts could be meters down and here we got something could it be a burial related item or will it be modern there oh i see it i see it it is it's a smashed bullet so that's from a modern rifle but uh, it's still a good find we have something here and we're gonna continue now into the forest look around a little bit here first and hopefully we will find an indicator of a burial mound Finns really love their sausages. This is from a sausage package. And I love sausages too. And probably even the Vikings loved sausages. And the Bronze Age people. Everyone just loves sausages, I think. It's universal. Joel is digging there and he keeps pulling up this treasure. More of that. That's iron nails but it's not just any nail. These are homemade. And that's a particularly interesting one. And Joe has another one. One more. And Home. there's still hundreds of signals, or at least tens. We're not sure about the age because nails pretty much look the same throughout the centuries. But these are home smithed and it might mean that there's a whole ship here. It could be a Viking ship burial. The location is awesome, right next to this bay. The ships could have pulled up here. And if not a burial, then maybe just a ship repair station. Because I'm sure they had lots and lots of nails on those ships. And sometimes you needed to add more. Look at this. Those guys were not made yesterday. At least a few hundred year old. What did you find there under the spruce? I found like almost 20 nails. There's still more signals. They're everywhere. Those same kinds of iron signals. So you don't think it's a ship burial anymore? It could be a ship burial or a ship repair station. We will probably never know. Too deep, too many roots. Too many too roots. Hard. There's like tens of signals still there, but I think we will head on for the bigger treasure let's keep looking for the real stuff it's somewhere out there oh hi there this is exactly what we are looking for a heap of stones and rocks with moss growing on top concealing what's beneath could this be a burial mound maybe we have to investigate with our detector, but I think this would have slipped through the careful eye of historians and archaeologists who have visited this place before. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. I just need one big strong signal here to prove my theory. I will turn every rock and stone to find out if this... Oh, that was my shovel. To find out if a chieftain is buried here. Or is it just my imagination? <sighs> but I'm getting desperate now. I've been here for 10 minutes. I spent 30 minutes of my life here. And it's wasted. Nothing. Nothing. <sighs> the life of a treasure hunter. But maybe on the next hill. Maybe. It's probably there. Let's go, y'all. Come on, stop filming. Have to go. 
it appears that we did not find what we came here looking for but that just means the treasure is gonna be out here next week when we're back with another video so if you haven't subscribed already consider doing that so you'll get the notification when the video is out and thank you guys for watching take care happy hunting true vikings out